I have some magic mail in here. It's gonna take a while. Hi everybody, my name is Meg and welcome to Megla is a Geek where we geek out about everything Disney, Star Wars, Marvel, and a few other things. If you are new here, hi and welcome. If you're returning, thank you for coming and geeking out with me once again. Ah, uh, it's a lot of bubble wrap. I have some magic mail today from some friends. Let's get straight into it. This I've had um, since March. This is from Karen over at Disney Inside Andy. I got to meet her and Abby Kate for breakfast one morning in March. We had a great time. Um, don't forget, you can check out every channel I talk about in the description. Give them all some love. They are some amazing people. So I like white grape um, Japanese candies that are brought back from World Showcase. So she gave me these sour fettuccine white grape strips. And I'm not a big fan of sour, but I really liked these. I have opened them and ate them, but I'm wearing my liners today. So I don't want to get into those right now, but they are delicious. And I don't think anyone wants to see, you know, the sour face that I make. And she also gave me this pen. It is a Merida Locket pen from Hong Kong Disney. She has it on the back. And it opens and there's Merida. It is so beautiful. I really don't want to take it off the backer at all. It says, Scotland, a, a determined princess and gifted archer who set on a heroic journey to undo a beastly curse. This is gorgeous. Thank you so much, Karen. I'm sorry it took me so long to show this on the channel. It got lost in the YouTube basket. <laughs> and thank you so much. Make sure you check her and Andy's channel out. It's called Disney Inside Andy. And Abby Kate shows up too. They are amazing people. They really are. The next one is from Stitching Up Disney. So Julia sent me some fun stuff. Um, I opened some Dorables because um, her and Lauren were collecting them and I had some that they both wanted so I just sent them to them. And she asked if there was any Dorables that I was looking for and I, I'm not that picky about my Dorables so let's see. Ooh, there's a card and make sure you check out Julia's channel Stitching Up Disney. She is a sweetheart. I love listening to her southern accent. It's so great. It says, hey there, sweet friend. Thank you so much for the trades. So happy to have another adorable sister. Hope you enjoy these as much as I do. Love always your friend, Julia, at Stitching Up Disney. So she sent me some cute stickers. And you've seen my Instagram a while ago. I, my mom, sorority, did a daddy daughter dance and it was troll themed and so I dressed up and we made a whole bunch of troll costumes so she sent me this troll sticker too yeah I still haven't seen those movies so she sent me a few adorables I actually gave some to a friend these are the ones that I kept so she had Lottie from Princess and the Frog, and she's so cute. That big dress in the back. And the ones I wanted out of that particular series, I think he's peeling, no, oh, it's okay, is the Jungle Book characters. I love Ka, I like reptiles, so. Ka and his little hypnotized interest in me eyes. And of course, I like my villains, Shere Khan. He's so cute. Okay, <laughs> I'm back. Um, so yeah, share gone. So thank you, Julia. Make sure you check out her channel. I also got a big Ariel on the package. So cute. Thank you. Yeah, that's a bad Okay, uh, moving on to the next thing. This is from Jake's Disney Afternoon. So thank you, Jake. 
Something like that. I know one thing is in there, so I had to wear my Atlantis attire because I know there's one thing in here I'm well aware of. So, the card. It is Prince John and Sir Hiss. Make from one geek to another. I hope these pins start your collection off for this underrated yet wonderful and wonderful film. Stay nerdy, Jake. Yay. I know the one thing that's in here. I'm just probably, he told me there was something else too. So. Okay. So he did tell me that he found this. Actually on Instagram, he sent me a picture of it. And a little bit later, he goes, did you get it? And I didn't understand what he was asking. He said he picked it up for me. So this is an open edition Milo and the Ulysses in the background. Disney pin for this year. If I can. So great that Atlantis is getting some serious love. Yay. Let's see the second thing is. Oh, this is adorable. Look at this. This is Milo and Kita, and they're kind of like little kids. You know, chubby kids. Oh, look at her cheeks. Just want to pinch them. And this is, I believe this is a box lunch pin. This is from me on Tuesday. It is so cute. Oh, I was my Atlantis love. Yay. Thank you so much, Jake. That is so sweet. He has one of the best vintage channels. So if you're looking for literally Disney afternoon, so the 90s, Chippendale, Rescue Rangers, Darkwing Duck, Tailspin, stuff like that. Like he is the one to go see. So make sure you check out Jake in the description along with Julia and Stitching Up Disney. I love her. And Karen, Andy, and I love you Kate over at Disney Inside Andy. The next thing is actually from my friend Mickey. All of that bubble wrap contained Elliot from the Main Street Electrical Parade over at Disneyland popcorn bucket and it lights up. I'm sure I'm not going to be able to make it so it so there it lights up a little bit if I turn off the Ooh, light up mostly. So yeah. <laughs> I'm getting used to the, I'm getting used to the ring light. So I loved, I've never seen the electrical parade at all, but I have the, the record. So I have the vinyl. She also sent a couple other things along with Elliot. He was very, he was packed very well. So the th couple of things that I put in here did not come in with Elliot, but I have to show you. She also sent me my rogue sticker from Dis from X Men. So a little Sam Wilson, because she knows I have a little crush on Sam Wilson. So my little Falcon. And this is actually um, in K-pop albums. Sometimes they have photo cards, and this is the photo card of E Took from the K-pop group Super Junior. I didn't get this one in my CD, so she managed. She got one and sent him to me. He's my crush. Yeah, I know you guys want to know who my K-pop crush is because that's important. She also sent me some pins. When I got the package, I unwrapped him and everything. I put the pins in here and before filming, I went to find all the pins, couldn't find them. Elliot the dragon was holding my pins. So always have a dragon guard your pins. Very important. So she said, I don't know where these pins are from. They are lounge fly pins, judging from the backing. This is an aerial pin. So if you guys know the pin set this belongs to, please put it in the description. Or I could just ask Mickey to put it in the description. I love Mickey. She's my super junior bestie, as well as my Disney bestie. One day I'm gonna go out to Disneyland and we're gonna hang out, I promise. This is another one out of that same series. 
and it is Mulan. I love it. It's so beautiful. I know, it's like, seriously, it's so pretty. So, and then she sent two other pins she thought I might like. Um, these are from a Disney Land and Disney World set. Uh, mystery boxes that you can get there. They are these giant cakes, and this is the Hercules cake. I don't know if you can see it. And you got this little emblem at the top, and you got that little flower that Meg picks. And the other one that she sent is the Ariel cake. Under the sea, do 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 do, under the sea. So, thank you so much, Mickey. I love them all. I really do. And of course, I love my Elliot. Okay, so that was going to be the end of the video, obviously, because the more I looked at this, the more I thought I had it. Like, it's so cute. And I'm like, I've seen it. That's how I knew it was box lunch, right? So this is a box that has been in the bottom of the YouTube basket that I have way over there. It has other things in it, but it also has some box lunch pins. Yeah, I already had <laughs> I bought it for myself. So Jake knew. Knows me well, I guess. <laughs> What's funny is I sent him two fantasy pens and he had bought one of them for himself and hadn't unboxed it yet. So this is just kind of weird karma, right? <laughs> so in the spirit of Jake, he gave away the extra pen that he had. I'm going to keep the Milo and Kita pen that he sent me. And I'm going to give this away in a giveaway for this video. So... A week from this video, I will put the date in the description because I'm not sure when this video is going up. But all you have to do is put hashtag Atlantis and you can be entered in to win the Milo and Keto pen that I bought for myself. So I can keep the one Jake gave me. The giveaway will be open for one week starting with when this video comes out. And in a future video, I will announce the winner and we will go through talk through Instagram on how to get this to you. So you have one week. Da, da, da. So I will put the one week deadline in the description. So I have lost my mind. I hope you guys have a great day and don't forget to always stay geeky. Bye.